it comes to summer, the pools are always busy, right? The parks are always busy. But what about the DMV? Well, I got to tell you, summer is actually one of their busiest times of the year, and you could end up waiting in line for hours with no need. Steve Abbott from the North Carolina DOT is here with us to break down all of the tricks that you need to know to save you time at the DMV. He's answering your questions as well. How do you get those questions to him? You text us those questions. The number is 336. 379-5775. Remember, this is a text only, so please don't call. All right, Steve, let's first and foremost start with this. COVID has impacted everything. How has it impacted the DMV? Well, it greatly impacted us because we had so many employees who during the COVID be to be with their kids, a lot of them. Others know for safety reasons, we closed down a lot of license offices and we've got them all back open except for a couple. Our processing staff is a lot smaller now because of COVID impacts. So it takes longer for us to turn around something. If you send something in by mail to uh, renew a license by mail, not renew a license, but get a handicap placard and other things. Okay, so with that, we know that there's impacts all around. I know one of the biggest things that you and I talk about every single time I talk to you is, hey, you need to tell everybody, do everything online. Let's talk about that. Okay, um, if you, you, most people can renew a license online. They can order a duplicate online. You can do registration can be done online. So as much as you can go online. In fact, if you don't have any special license issues, you don't even have to go to a license office every 10 or 16 years. Wow, that is a long time in between. Okay, and the big thing is people always say, well, maybe I'll just call and it'll be easier. And we got to tell you, first and foremost, your local um, DMV offices, don't call them because they cannot make appointments. There's only one place to call, but there's an interesting tidbit about what happens when you call. You're going to be waiting a while. They get uh, thousands of calls a week and the same staff, the customer service staff is smaller. So you may have to try a few times to be on hold for quite a while. That's why if you use our contact us email system, you'll probably get better service. Or if you take care of things online or look on our website, we get a lot of inquiries how to do certain things and it's all on the website. Well, and the thing is too, if you call to make an appointment online, they're looking at the very same online site that everybody else is at home too. It's not like they have a special, you know, back way to get in there. Exactly. So basically you can go online yourself and take care of it and just, a minute or two, or you can go and be on hold for a couple of hours. All right, let's not do that. All right, we've got several questions for you already. This person says, how can you get a change of address on your license? That's another online item. You can take care of that by ordering a duplicate license. State law requires your current license to be, or current address to be on your license. Just go online and order a duplicate. It allows you for an address update. It allows for an address update. Do you have to upload any documents or anything like that? Nope. Okay, that's easy enough. All right, this person says, my license from another state expired nine years ago. I've lived here eight years. Where do I begin the process of getting my license or my ID again? You wanna make an appointment at a license office because you're gonna have to go in with a bunch of documents and so forth and start the driver license process all over again. All right, so they're gonna have to start all over. Now, when it comes to documents, whether it's for that or the real ID or whatever else, a lot of folks said, hey, I didn't know that I needed the original document. Can't I just bring a copy? That is no, you have to have the original. And again, on our website explains they don't accept copies of birth certificates or things that might be a little easier to uh, counterfeit or make uh, improper copies of. So you need to bring, for example, your birth certificate that has the um, emblem on it and things like that. You need originals, an original social security card, a photocopy or just a picture on your phone is not going to do it. Yeah, we want to make sure that we're saving you some frustration and some time. For those of you at home, make sure you bring the originals. Uh, this next person is asking, when will North Carolina allow Class A licenses to renew online and why they don't, why don't they allow it right now? We don't allow any of our CDLs to renew online. That is state law, so any changes like that would have to come from the legislature. That's not something that we determine. Okay, uh, and this person says, can you make online appointments? And the answer is yes. And I know the last time we talked, you said they were 45 days out, but you were hoping that they would be stretched out longer. Actually, they were 75 days out for a while this morning, and then we hit a glitch and it's back to 45, but that shows how close we are to opening up and 75 days would take everybody through the end of August. 
so the rest of the sort of unofficial summer, you know, the June, July, and August. But you're right, they are backed up quite a bit for several reasons. So if you went in right now, most places you're not going to get an appointment until at least late July. All right, and the hope is that one day we'll have an appointment system that does 180 days? That's the goal because you can renew your license six months in advance. So if you have to go to an office to do that, for some reason you can't do it online, the notice will be, hey, as soon as you get that notification, it's time to renew, you can go to an office and take care of it that quickly. All right, we are continuing to take your text questions. We've got one more segment. We're going to take a quick break. We'll be right back.